So welcome back everybody. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a live stream, obviously. We are in creative on survival 0.1617. I've just got my old world eater out because um, I want to see how much resources I can collect in the old girl. So I took the top off this planet to make my factory and I'm going to put this as my new faction base. Yelby will be joining me in his reskin. Sup Yelby? Sup? And um, yeah, so that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to do a resource hunt and then we'll speed it up. And uh, at the end, I'll tell you how much I managed to get. So half an hour with this thing. So let's dock up inside. Huh. So here we have the World Eater in all its glory. It's an old ship now, but it had um, like a little inspection, like a little briefing room area, and then it had like a staircase, gravity, elevator, or whatever. This was the block demo. Oh wow, that's cute. Look, look, this was the block demo when I made this ship. That was that was all of them, man. You know, obviously it didn't have every color, but. <laughs> no way. Or maybe it was every block that was used on this ship. That would probably make more sense. But then why only these terrain types? Huh? 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 But still, it's quite cute. This is supposed to be like a cargo area, basically. And then upstairs is medical and cryo. So yeah, it's pretty self-explanatory. And then we come up here. We have like alien holding pens. And I think the top floor was like a bio lab. He had different biomes for research. And uh, yeah, you can just jump off the back here. There's a way out there. I think, was there room for my surfboard to dock outside? Oh, maybe that was a retrofit. But yeah. And then this is the mech hanger, basically. That's why it's, it's on the ceiling, so it docks upside down. And it faces out the back door. Makes sense. But yeah, um, basically I dot the core there and just use the arrows. Switch up to the core room, which is up here. Don't know why the doors are open though. There we go. And then the idea is face it, zap it. It's got no recharges. Oh dear. I'll probably have to put like a plate of recharges on the front of it or something. Anyway, let's go find some.
So yeah, um, I'm actually going to put a couple of these, two of them, one for the ores because I like to separate things. You don't need to though. It's funny. So ores in one. Wait for it to start doing stuff. Why is it not doing stuff? There it is. Okay, so you put it in, you wait for it to cycle. Oh, I put another one in. I don't know if we're going to be able to do this forever, but this is how I'm doing it at the moment. It may be that you need one factory for each item, um, but at the moment you can just do this. I'm picking what? up shards at random, I'm just floating here. Oh, really? Nice. Bring them down. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds good. Free loot. Right, if I just do that and see if it... Yeah, it can deal. So, off it goes. It's gonna... So, half an hour, in a minute, it'll tell me, you know, and then I'll know how many capsules you can expect to get from, you know, because that's a 63 million credit mining ship, so it should be... You know, it should bring in a decent yield. Not to mention all the rest of the stuff which it had. So, where are the Plex storage? Here we go. So, let's go into Plex storage. So, what else have I got on me from that? I've got 1,500 sand, 31,000 varus, 12,000 lava, 19,000 cinnabar, 28,000 sujil, 21,000 lucra, 6,000 red dirt, and 14,000 tect. And then from the station, 100,000 grain we, hull. We, you, you see why the game is balanced the way it is with crafting. Yeah, because look at it. Like, if I just go and get a salvage ship... It's it's really hard to balance between a guy with a fabricator and a uh, you know, $60 yeah. million dollar salvage ship. Exactly, yeah. But like I say, if you're going to work up towards a decent salvage ship, which you could design in build mode in single player with infinite money, you know, this is, you know, this is, I think it shows that it's easy to, you know, it's easy to take it. Like, because I've been playing for, what, half hour? I know I used some admin commands initially, but the argument is that if I had a 63 million credit ship at that point, I must have had some residual income or like some I must have had something <laughs> to buy what I've started with here so actually I should have a buttload of money we've actually had people who already hit max credits average players are starting to get their first billion and um, so people are loving it I really love what you've done here with the uh, Chris with this rock here right shift for info the Larimar it's a really so nice scheme. It's a really nice color scheme. Uh, the shards go in the bottom. I'll go stand on it. Shards go in the bottom. Bottom one over here. Cannot activate. Yeah, another. Can oh, make. really? Faction protection. Mm-hmm. Faction protection. Just drop them on the floor. Like, drop them right in front of me. Oh God, Yelby. Just drop in lava. Every why are you standing on lava? Because <laughs> I can. You you're, you're messing up the, the oh. lighting, man. Messing up the lighting, dude. Right. So you've dropped them on me, yeah? Nice. Okay, so I'll just chuck them in here then. Uh, I don't see them. Did someone else? Oh, here they are. It keeps trying to pick They're them all up. They're over on. here. Yeah, I'm picking them up. Uh, maybe, what, did it just and fill up my... kind of filled up my inventory, what? Well, anyway, I'll chuck them all in. It would be nice... Because don't you need a certain amount to make... Because you always seem to end up with an overflow. You know, you always seem to end up with, like, a couple of them left over. Is that because it needs a certain amount? One to make ten, no. Must be in the next, yeah, it's in the next stage. It's in the micros, right. Okay, so basically what I'm gonna do from here is I'm gonna expand this factory. Um, let's have a quick look at what we've actually got 
in terms of crystals right now. So crystals, 500, 500, 500. Wow, so yeah. Hundreds of crystals, ores, 600, 600. So loads of ores as well. So yeah, like half hour of mining really gets you set up for crafting. So I'm gonna let that just cook away.